Hi guys, welcome to another video of New Tricks, the Scent Guy. Today is basically the step on how to upgrade the firmware of your boutique scent from Rolden. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go on Rolden website and you need to download the firmware. But before you do anything, in the section when you download the firmware, so if I have, in this case, I've got a D05, I go check if I have the right firmware in the D05 to know if I need to update it or not. On the website of Roland, you have the information how to check. And every boutique has a different way to check the firmware. So in this case, if you look at the page where you download it, and they say, before you start, check the system program version of your D05. So hold down patch bank one and turn on the machine and you keep your finger on the button that they ask. And then on my screen, I've got a version app, so firmware 1.03. And now we have 1.05. So, okay, I need to update because I don't have the same number. My number is older, fine. So I'm going to turn it off and turn it back on. And then to have your boutique appear in um, the state of being able to be updated, you need to hook up the USB cable between your computer and the boutique scent and turn on the boutique following, again, the list of buttons that is on Roland website. So it could be in this case, it could be you press on patch number eight while you turn it on and it will be in patch a firmware update mode and it will appear as a hard drive. So it's there. The firmware that you did download, that's the most important part, is a zip file. It needs to be unzipped and in that you'll have a folder and in the folder there's one file that finished by a dot bin dot b i n that's the file you need to put in the d05 or in the boutique synth so i'm just going to take that file drop it into this folder it is being copied in the d05 now i'm going to disconnect the drive and then i want to i want to say to the d05 run the installer run the firmware updates i'm going to press on the number again they say press the patch number eight and press on it and it says updating. So I'm just waiting for the numbers to go from zero to 100% in this case. In other machines where you don't have a screen with numbers, you'll see a lines of lights lit up and you'll have to follow what's on the screen telling you when all these lights are on, it's time to turn it off and turn it back on or whatever. So there's, depending on the machine, it's gonna be written over there. So I'm gonna 90 and 100%. Complete, please reboot. So again, I'm gonna turn it off. I'm gonna press on the one patch bank, turn back on to see the number, and it says 1.05, so it was updated correctly. Turn it down and turn it back on. I have the latest update and the D05. So that's it, this is how you update it. Very fast, just to be sure, do not put the zip folder. It needs to be unzipped, and in the zip folder there is a dot bin. That's the file you need to put in the drive before you unconnect it or you eject the drive from the computer and you do start the updating on the machine itself. That's it. Just follow the information on the website and you'll be good with that. Cheers.